He might be weirder than me. We're in Leavenworth <laughs> for my mom's birthday. <clears throat> Just hanging out with the fam. This is the house we're staying in. Love sauerkraut cool. and kimchi. Plan while we're in Leavenworth is to go. We're to going to every coffee shop. And then we're gonna drink it. And we're gonna drink the coffee. We're gonna shop. rate it on good vibes and good coffee. Well, the scores are ambiance, good vibe, barista etiquette. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. They have to have a good balance of cool and cool and kind. Interesting questions. And life. good coffee. And good coffee with African beans. I don't know what the option. I think the be. best There's option no right trail. now is to drive. drive. You can almost walk on top. A six-man oh. squad and a, and a five-man car. Oh, oh, hey guys. What do you think, Leo? We'll take turns. Coffee shop is J5. I'm gonna Let me get some chocolate covered. <laughs> I'm gonna do a pour over. Okay, what size? Uh, it's eight. Get some, Leo. Toffee. Oh, not oh. an African bean. No, it wasn't supposed to be. <laughs> it's a good coffee. I just don't like the bean type. Eating out of the J5. It's out of five. Okay, I would give the coffee a three. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'd give the environment a three point five. Yeah. And the kindness of the um, barista five. Five out of five for, uh, kindness. for barista, barista kindness. <laughs> the coffee. The coffee is very normal coffee. Basically, yeah. It's like Italian roast black. What we got here. That's the review of the J5 coffee shop. Next coffee shop coming up. It was yesterday's. All right, back to our review of the coffee. We had some morning coffee. It was okay. It was probably like one out of five. It was a little oily. The barista was kind of rude. Give it a four total. So we're gonna go look for some real coffee with a real barista. I don't think there's any out here though. <laughs> it looks like we've come up to some sort of electric fence. We're gonna have to see if it, if it shocks us or not. Gah! It's just string. <laughs> How's your coffee? It's hot chocolate. How is it? Sweet. <laughs> Yummy! At the reindeer farm. Happy reindeer farm? At the reindeer farm. Oh. Loving it. They didn't have coffee, but they had hot chocolate. So, five out of five for hot chocolate, but that's not part of the game, so. I don't know about being TripAdvisor's number one thing. Is this the number one thing to do in Leavenworth? Yeah, it's pretty okay. Hey buddy. All right. We're back in Leavenworth. Gonna get some coffee. Leo's tired, I'm tired. We're all getting grumpy. Remember, hey. It's time for a cup of joe. Go to ArgoNet. ArgoNet Coffee Roses. Turns out Leavenworth doesn't really have any coffee shops. Leo's got our map, we don't know where to go. Pointed out on the map. Right there. Right there. Okay, nice. What's a cortado? It's just like a tiny latte, still two shots. It's good. Drip coffee and then one of those. Is that granola? Yes. Is that homemade? It is. Yeah. Oh. That was really close to the This looks like it was made for Leah. 
<laughs> I'm not a fan of the beans. Let me see. Ah. Uh, oh, there we go. Hello. <laughs> Looking good. What are you sitting on, Leo? Argo Not Coffee. I'd give it a, a four for coffee, four for good vibes, and a four. What was the other one? Nice baristas. Mm -hmm. But really, the best thing there is the uh, the granola bar. Oh yeah, I was getting. So Argonaut Coffee takes the lead. Um, it's a little bit out of the way, and it's outdoors, so it's cold. But they know what they're doing. I'm into that coffee. <laughs> and. What polar bear? The one at Cabela. We had a mean cup of coffee this morning. Sister made a French press, and now we're at Sandy's, and we're gonna get ourselves a nice diner cup of coffee. Yeah. So far, Tori's coffee's been the best. <laughs> best coffee in Leavenworth was homemade at our own house. We'll see if Sandy's can can beat that. Also, it's snowing here. Beautiful day. Coffee here is bad. Hi! There's no good coffee shops in Leavenworth. The, nope. be the best one is the Argo Net. No, and it was my own Stump Town Coffee. The brew. best one is Tori Colavecchio Coffee. So Second best, if you don't have Tori with you, is the Argo Net Coffee Shop way down the way. But you can't sit inside, so if it's snowing. J5. J5 is okay. And then Starbucks is down there, but who cares? Don't Leavenworth. say the S word. <laughs> Leavenworth is a fine city. It's really cute and quaint. If you like to buy stuff from junk shops and walk around junk by shops. pretty rivers, and the snow is nice. It's snowy. Yeah, if you like Germans, this is the place for you. The treacherous snowstorm. I don't know if we're gonna make it. I don't even know if we're at the right trailhead. Just went past the road close sign. So I'll, I think that's how you know we're getting close to where we need to be. Is it beautiful? Alright, the rest of our gang gave up. Two miles is too much for them to handle. So Tori and I are gonna finish the rest of our run. <sighs> so I'm hiking on this here edge of the cliff. It's a little bit steep. We made it to the end. Now we need to book it to catch back up with the rest of our crowd. <sighs> ah, it's not made for long distances. Ah, we dwarves are natural born sprinters. Hi, the colas. 
are not runners. Ah. Ah. Just dropped my camera again. This Joby pod, I'm telling you what, I need to get a new head for it. It does not hold the camera on. Ah, it's so scary. My buns are soggy, my feet are soggy, my knees are soggy, my camera is soggy, but I had to go off and get a couple more shots of that beautiful river, and uh, yeah, Leavenworth is a beautiful place. They have terrible coffee, but they have great scenery, so uh, yeah, that was the, uh, the old pipeline trail. See you guys next time on Cole Adventures.